Did you know that you can make an extra $150 per day and over $4,000 per month just by creating one single video? With the power of AI, you can now repurpose videos created for one client like this one and sell it to multiple businesses in the same niche without spending any extra money or time on writing scripts or editing videos. And today we'll show you just how you can do this in five easy steps with the help of ChatGPT and InVideo even if you're a complete beginner to video creation. Make sure you stick around till the end because we will also show you the exact process for using this video to generate more money on a continuous basis. Let's get started. The first step is finding your gig. Online platforms like Upwork, Freelancer.com, Guru.com, as well as communities on Slack, Facebook, and Twitter are great places to look for high paying video editing gigs. We found one on Upwork that has the requirement for a promo video for a skincare consultation brand and pays $150. The reason to find a paid gig instead of simply creating a promo video for your portfolio is twofold. One, you get paid for the effort that you put in right away. And two, you have social proof that businesses in this particular niche are indeed looking for videos like these. Now, once you have your gig, the next step is to create the copy for the kind of video your client needs. Thankfully, with ChatGPT, you can do this in minutes. Start by signing up or signing into your ChatGPT account. And once you're logged in, you will see the prompt box at the bottom of the screen to give the AI prompts for the kind of script or copy you want. As with any AI tool, how you write your prompts will massively drive the success of your video. Now, a prompt for a promo video will be slightly different from that for a YouTube or a social media video. And so an easy way to simplify this is to ensure that you include the following key elements in your prompt. The viewpoint that you would like ChatGPT to adopt, such as marketeer, business owner, doctor, etc. The type of video you want, such as promo video, Instagram ad video, etc the product or service and the target consumer for your video. For instance, a promo video for a skincare consultant catering to women over 35. The length of the video, such as 30 seconds, one minute. The tonality you are going for, such as funny, witty, cheeky, etc. And any additional details you want in the output, such as having an intro slogan or including references to celebrities. For now, we are creating a mock version of the video for the purpose of this tutorial. So here's how we will write the prompt for that. A detailed prompt like this ensures that you get a fairly detailed script from the get-go. Once you click enter, ChatGPT creates the script in real time. It takes a couple of minutes depending on how long your video is or how complicated the topic is. Now, once you have the first draft, you can read through and see if you want any changes. If you do, you can just give the AI additional prompts. I feel that the current script is very wordy and it includes a lot of dialogue that requires filming and it's just very long. So I am going to prompt the AI to fix all of these issues. We want to make it shorter, remove dialogues and regenerate it in a way that it can be created with just text and music. Often it doesn't take more than one or two iterations to get the kind of script you want. You can also see that ChatGPT has given a storyboard for the kind of clips you can use. This is going to come in super handy while we are creating the video. Now, once you have your copy, it's time to start creating your video. Log into InVideo and go to the text to video workflow in the dashboard. This will open up a library of templates to choose from. Spend some time here going through the various templates. You can hover your cursor over any one to preview what it looks like. At this stage, you are looking for a template that fits in with the theme of your video in terms of transitions, text animations, and music. You don't need to worry about the color palette at this stage because that is something that you can easily change while editing the video. Now, once you've chosen your template, select your aspect ratio and then click on use template to go to the editor. Here you have your main canvas area where you will see your scenes on the right side of the screen and you have your script box on the left. Now, all you need to do is simply paste your ChatGPT copy into the script box. Make sure you only paste the copy and not the storyboard media suggestions. Press enter to break down any long sentences and then select the box for auto suggesting media. Make sure that premium stock media options are also selected and then click on create scenes. In video will then create video scenes for the entire script in real time. Now, once your scenes are created, you want to go ahead and customize the video to ensure that you get the best possible end result. 
We will start by replacing the automatically selected media clips with the ones that are more relevant to our video. To change the media, you will need to access the assets menu on the extreme left of the screen. Simply select the scene where you want to change the clip and then go to the video tab in the assets menu. Here, use the search bar to type in keywords and search for relevant clips. Our first line of text talks about glowing skin, so we want to showcase a woman looking in the mirror and worried about her skin. Use a few different keyword combinations to find relevant results. Once you find a clip you like, I like this one, simply drag and drop it onto the canvas and hit replace in the pop-up window that appears. This will open up another pop-up window where you want to trim the duration of the clip to fit the scene. Simply select this option on the bottom of the screen that says trim video to fit scene and then click on add and your media will replace the template default. Do this for as many scenes as you feel necessary. Now once your media is replaced, you can use the controls on top of the canvas to make adjustments such as adjusting the colors, adding effects and even changing the animation. The next part of customizing your video is making adjustments to the text. To do that, you can simply select the text box on any scene and then use the controls on top to change the font, size, animation and even the color palette for the entire video. Simply go to the text effects option on top of the screen which is represented by this little wand icon. Here, choose the colors you want to use for the text background fill. Make sure you check this box on the bottom of the color selector that says replace all and your video's color palette will be changed. I like all of the other details such as the font and the animation for now, so I'm going to let them stay as is. The final part of your video customization is your music. Now the template already comes with the default music track, but if for some reason you don't like it, go to the music tab in the left asset menu and search for music tracks based on mood or genre. Once you find a track you like, simply click on the plus icon next to it and you will get a pop-up asking if you want to replace the current music track. Click on yes and your music will be changed. Now before you go ahead and finalize your video, make sure you also replace the default template logo with your own. This is super important for brand recognition. Simply click on the logo on any scene and this will open up the logo menu on the left. Here, just upload your own logo image and once it's uploaded, simply click on it and it will get replaced throughout the template. And with that, you have your final video. Now, once all your elements are locked, it's time to preview your video. Simply click on the play button underneath the canvas to view what your video looks like. And that has turned out to be pretty great. Once you're happy with the results, go to the top right corner of the screen and hit export. We suggest exporting in 180p for the best results. Now, once your video is ready, you need to realize that a promo video like this is essentially a product that you can sell multiple times. Kind of like a stock media clip, but tailor made to a specific industry or niche. Once you have this video, you can pitch it to multiple clients with minimal edits and continue making money. For this particular video, we will start by looking for other dermatologists and skincare clinics in our local area that offer similar services. You can do this on Google itself. And once you have a list of potential clients, reach out to them via social media, LinkedIn and email and pitch your video as an investment that will help their business grow. Make sure you include your prices in the pitch as well. Start with a fixed rate for those who want the video without any edits and create a pricing tier to account for any edits or customizations such as changing the media or adding voiceovers. Once you have a few conversions, you can upsell to the same clients by offering video bundles. And this way you can essentially continue to make money by creating a single video with the help of ChatGPT and in video. Don't forget to check out these videos next to understand how you can use AI to create multiple different types of videos and grow your video editing business.